almost there. It's turned into a longer drive because I mean, it makes sense, but you don't get like the Verbo address until right, like the day of. So my mom just sent it to me and I thought I was 20 minutes away because I just put in Broken Bow, but it's actually, I was like 50 minutes away. So now I'm in Broken Bow, but I still have like 30 minutes to get up to where, which is crazy that it's 30 minutes, but it's only 10 miles away. Like, I feel like that's a long time just to go 10 miles, but it'll take you 30 minutes. But anyways, Oh, that's a rough angle. Almost there. I keep hitting crazy storms. So that's another thing is I've been like really focused, but they're like flash flood storms. Makes me think of that joke in the office. But yeah, it's crazy. It'll just be bright and sunny. Excuse me. And then it'll just start pouring like crazy, but only for like, I don't even know, like two, three minutes. And then I got a break in the rain and then I'm driving I'm at a red light. Then I'm driving even more and for like 30 seconds it's sunny again and then I can see the rain in front of me and it's like a misty wall of rain and I'm driving into the wall. It was crazy and then it just started pouring and that was only like 30 seconds and then that was the worst of the rain. It keeps like drizzling off and on but then what's crazy is some of the roads, not where I am now, I'm in like a town right now but the back roads were I say like yeah back roads there weren't a lot of people on there but you're going like 70 they would just have like huge puddles of water like it wasn't raining there but there's a bunch of water and puddles from the rain that had just gone through and oh my gosh I have never hit a large puddle of water when driving I guess because it scared me it like was messing my car all around moving it all around and it was kind of scary but all right like I said I'm not in a crazy place right now I'm just going 15 in a small town but for sake of safety I'm going to check in with you guys in 30 minutes when I get there bye <laughs> So this place is super cool. It's actually nighttime. We had dinner and then went to the grocery store and then came back and watching a movie and now we are getting in the hot tub. So yeah, I'll try to do a better job of <laughs> keeping up with what we're doing, but first night's been pretty fun. I'm gonna relax in the hot tub. Probably won't stay up too late because I think we're going on a hike pretty early tomorrow morning. So yeah, I think it's like 9.30 right now. So I'm sure we'll hang out in there for a little bit, finish the movie we're watching. We can watch it from the hot tub and then probably go to bed pretty early. I love this view so much. This is like a dream shower. It's just so cool seeing the trees just right there. Good morning, it is day two, it is Friday. Just got up and had some cereal. And now we're gonna go on a hike. So I need to get ready for that. Whenever I'm getting ready, I dump out all my stuff on the counter. And then as I get ready, I'll put them back into the bag. on the hike. Sasquatch, we found some footprints.
All right, we finished our hike. I got some cool footage. Oh, Emerson, if you wanna be in it, you gotta come stand by me over here. Oh, um, this is Emerson. He's been on my channel since he's a little baby. And now tell him what we're gonna do. I'm gonna play games. Play some games. Bye. Really cool, so I'm actually excited to try it out. Have you guys used a rain shower before? It seems so cool. Look at that. Got this cool view too. If you're curious what I packed for this trip, I did a little pack with me, prep for vacation video that I think already went up before this one, so go check that out. This romper actually got from Wish.com. That's another video on my channel if you wanna see everything I got from there, but I love this romper, I wear it a ton. It's such an easy, just quick thing to throw on. I think I paid a few dollars for it. But yeah, it's like 5.15, so I have a little bit of time before we go, but my parents eat really early so that's why i wanted to shower get ready so i actually showered with my ring on this is my eye do ring anyone who's curious i don't usually shower with it on but i was you know touching a bunch of stuff bug spray and sunscreen and it needed a good wash so i kept it on usually i keep it on when i wash my hands and that's how i keep it clean but i just decided to keep it on while i did the full shower. This place has been really fun. It's like a good mix of fun stuff going on and also just relaxing. I've actually been reading my book. If anyone's curious, it's called The Blinds. Look it up. It's really, really good. It's actually a story. Well, it's a fictitious story based in Texas. So it's kind of cool to read about it. I feel like this is foggy. This whole room is foggy from my shower. Is that good? That's better. Okay. Deodorant, of course. Perfume, I'm going with the Clean Beauty Hello Summer perfume. This has been like my go-to this summer. I love it. It's the perfect amount of sweet and clean and just light and airy. It kind of reminds me of like a, in a good way, it kind of reminds me of like an Abercrombie Hollister sweet cologne smell. And I can't do this very well when I'm far away. So we'll see how this turns out. Oh, yep, already got it up on the eyebrow. Did the brows real quick. If you're curious what mascara and stuff I use, I did put that in my last video so I won't bore people who have watched both. All right, so I just need to let my hair air dry or maybe blow dry depending on the time they wanna go. But other than that, I'm ready to go. If anyone's curious, I'm wearing these sandals that I got from Shein. I actually just had a Shein haul go up. I think it goes up tomorrow on my channel, but it'll be like, two weeks ago when y'all are watching this. Yeah, go check that out if you're curious some other Shein goodies that I got recently, but this is what I will be wearing tonight with this one. We realized that it is more intense than we thought, so my nephew probably couldn't do it. But we're not gonna be getting that anymore. We thought we could find kind of like a kid-friendly one, but they all seem, they all have like rapids and drops and stuff like that, so probably won't be doing that. So I'm gonna get ready. I think they said something about us going to play mini golf. <sighs> yeah, I need some caffeine. I'm 
dragging, so. <laughs> Update, apparently there is a coffee shop nearby, so I have some food stops so I can get coffee on the way to our adventure, because I'm just I'm tired today. But I'm not sure how active we're gonna be, but I'm gonna be wearing sports bra. I really like this one, I got it from Victoria's Secret. These shorts are Halora, very wrinkled. And then just this t-shirt that Taylor got me in Montana. Fun fact, his mom and dad side of the family are from Montana. my cool new hat. Just finished reading my book and now we're going to grill and play the Wii outside on the back deck. All right, we just played a ton of Just Dance. It's getting late, I think it's already at 10 o'clock, so we promised my nephew we would in the hot tub, so. changes to some PJs and I think we're gonna watch a movie. It's a kids movie with my nephew before we go to bed for the night. Good morning, it is Sunday. It's our last day here. We have to check out within like an hour or so. So I'm gonna go ahead and wash my nasty hair and get packed up and clean up this place a little bit. <laughs>
forgot to show y'all but these are the new socks that I got Taylor when I was on vacation. He likes funky socks and I wanted to get him something related to Bigfoot and then this one was all medical, which Taylor works at a hospital and is a pharmacist so I thought this was perfect. I just gave it to him and he liked it a bunch, so. All right guys, I made it home. Trip is over. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. I hope it wasn't too long or boring. I hope you like, comment, and subscribe down below and I will see you in my next one. Bye. We're both sitting up at that point, like just staring at the door. And then it gets like, someone starts knocking and then it gets like loud. It's like, like really loud. And then he was like, what the heck? And he runs up and he goes and looks through the peephole. He saw the guy taking a couple steps back and was preparing to run in, like try to knock the door down. And then he yells, go to my closet. So I start running to hide in his closet. I hear like this loud boom, like really loud. 